Howdy y'all, Fast Force 289, welcome back. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how to hook up and wire a three terminal light up toggle switch like you'd put in your car or truck to light up fog lights or whatever that may be. This clip is actually a clip that I took out of my last video, me installing the fog lights on my 77 Ford truck. If you ain't checked that out, go check that out. So let's jump into it and see what we got. All right, so the switch I'm gonna be using to hook these fog lights up are a three terminal switch. It lights up whenever you engage the power, turn the lights on. And if you don't know how to hook one of these up, it's very simple. It tells you right here, you have power, load, and ground. So ground is obviously a given, that's a ground. You find a good chassis ground. The power is the power coming out of like your fuse box, coming into the switch. The load is whatever you are trying to power. So in other words, the fog lights would hook into this terminal. So your power wire in the vehicle would hook here, the power going in, the power coming out of the switch is here to send signal to the lights to turn them on. And then whenever you do that, this will turn this light here on to let you know that there is power going through the switch and lighting or engaging whatever it is you have hooked to the switch. Very simple, uh, nothing to it. I'm gonna go ahead and make my ground wire for this. And the way I'm gonna ground it is just ground it to the bracket. So it'll just be a real short wire to go from here to here, almost like a jumper wire kinda. There we go. Now our ground is ready to go. Just like so. That's gotta run the uh, power wire and the wire for the lights. You can see that it lights up. I got it where it comes on with the key on only. So it don't come on in accessory. It only comes on with the key on. I can turn it on and off as I want to. All right, and if we look up in here, you can see the switch here, how it's, how it's mounted. So this is the ground like I showed before, how it's looped at the top here, it loops around and comes ground to right here. This is your load wire, which would be light wire. And you see how it's the black wire going straight on through. I got it routed over the steering column and going through the firewall. And here's the power wire. I made the power wire that's actually got the power coming into the switch red to, since it's underneath the dash, you won't see it, to note that that is in fact a power wire. This is technically a power wire going to the lights but it's power coming out of the switch, not going in. So this is power coming in when the key is on. You see here, they lit up just like they're supposed to be. Yeah. All right, guys, well, that's all there is to it. That's done. Uh, it turned out really well. It was real simple to wire the switch up. Like I said, there's nothing to it. And that's how you light up one of those lighted switches. And it's a nice feature because now whenever it tur switch is turned on, it'll light up to let you know that it's on. So that's a nice feature. Uh, yeah, it's real simple. So if y'all like the video, give me a thumbs up. I'd appreciate that. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. I'd always appreciate that as well. And I thank each and every one of y'all for watching each and every day. I think that is great and amazing. And if you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them in the drop box down below and I'll get back to you. And uh, that's it. So uh, thank y'all for watching. I appreciate it. I'll see y'all in the next one. Take care.